What is going on guys? So we are back at Pixelball Games in Ontario, California. And guys, they're doing a buy sell trade event today. So we actually brought a Super Mario clock that we're gonna try to trade for some credit. Maybe we can get at least $15 for it. I don't know. We're gonna go see our buddy Vic. I think he might want it. So uh, let's go ahead and see what they got. Yo, check this out. How you been, man? Mr. Manny, how you doing? Oh, doing great, brother. Doing great. Got some coffee Mr. going Mark through King. the veins. <laughs> <laughs> 8-bit Retro Vic, guys. Check them out. 8-bit Retro Vic 64. Gonna sign this thing for Where's a good spot? Where's a good spot? Right here? Right there. There it is, right there. Manny's Arcade. Keep it retro. <laughs> Keep on playing, Manny. Keep on playing, baby. Alright, guys, we got Lopez Girl right here. What did you pick up today? What did you get from the event? So, this is from the Upland store. Smackdown vs. Raw 2008. Featuring ECW on that one. Yeah. Smackdown, oh, Smack, not really. Uh, Kingdom Hearts, Birth nice. by Sleep, Minty, and then we got this Grail right here. Dang! Look at that. It's in the back, but it doesn't matter. Whoever's got a back piece for her, hit her up. Let her know. She Please. Needs it. That's awesome, man. And of course, you can't forget this. Woo! Beautiful. She me, mama, me, me. Right, what do you want? The Plumber Brothers. <laughs> you want to do trades or do you want to add? Let's do a store credit. All right, man. Not like this, that's what I'm saying. Thanks a lot. Appreciate it. <laughs> Andy, right on. There we go, guys. We're going to do some, uh, some little trade here. So. Andy always puts the good stuff. <laughs> you got to go see him. I hide it all the time. <laughs> <laughs> Now 8-Bit Retro Vic had a lot of really cool stuff on his table, but this GameCube right here really stood out. I mean, look at this thing. It is completely blinged out. Now his wife actually blings consoles. Check out some of her cool stuff. All right, guys, so I was looking at the Game Boys right here, and I fell in love with this one because I love green. It's my favorite color. And 8-Bit uh, Retro Vic's going to hook us up for $50, man. No way. Yes way. Oh my god, I can't believe it guys. We're going home with the Game Boy Color, man. Thank you so much, brother. Appreciate it. Let's go. So, yeah, so before it was like Nintendo 64, uh -huh. they were trying to name it Ultra 64. This color thing was in development, early development right then. Right. So it's kind of an old school hat. With an old tag on it too, so. Yeah, man. Oh, that's super cool, People man. People trying awesome. to scalp it off me today. I almost so. got it. I wanted to get it. So going through this table right here, they have a really cool God of War PSP, complete in box, really good condition. Also that Cowabunga collection for the PS5. You can't go wrong with the Sega Saturn. But guys, check out this Neo Geo Pad 2. Now I've never seen one of these complete in box and it is awesome. Being a Neo Geo fan, I love it. They also had this Japanese VMU for the Sega Dreamcast from Sonic Team. Now this thing is awesome, man. And you guys know, I love the Dreamcast. I also found Mickey's Mousecapades for the NES. Now for $25, it's just missing the manual. That's not a bad deal at all. And I love finding these things, man. These old school Super Mario McDonald's toys. Now these are super nostalgic. They scream the 90s. And I just, I love finding stuff like this. I honestly think no game room, retro room, or toy room is complete without these Super Mario McDonald's toys. Now, there's a whole row of Dreamcast games right here, guys, but oh man, I gotta save that for another episode. Really good selection at GameCube, though. Check that out. <laughs> Alright, guys, we're here with Lou Dog Games. 
This is the man right here. It's actually his birthday today, so happy birthday, man. Yeah, so. Great guy, he actually had a tiara on. It's right there. It said happy birthday on it, but he took it off for the video. But guys, it's his birthday and he gave us a gift. WrestleMania, bro. Hulkamania's running wild, man. And what you gonna do when the whole world full of Hulkamanias destroy you? Let's go, dude. Thank you, brother. I appreciate you, man. Happy birthday. Thank you, bro. <laughs> With the one and only right here, Mode what 7. What's up, brother? How you been? Not bad. I just put out my brand new Bandra Kazooie mixtape. Oh, snap. Check it so out. You can check that out. Grab one here in person or find it on Spotify. Yeah, you've been all over social media doing performing all over the place and oh, stuff. Yeah, That's awesome, pushing. dude. See you up there all the time. Keep too. it up, brother. I'm always on the road now. <laughs> check out this Friday the 13th mask from the NES game. No doubt, I'm gonna regret not picking that one up. Would've looked great in the collection. And who remembers these Nickelodeon puzzle games? Did you guys ever have these? Now I tried to look for a commercial of this game and I just couldn't find one anywhere. And these Battletoad styrofoam hands are just super cool, man, and I, I really regret not picking these up as well. Those are five bucks each. Oh, these are neat, dude. Bigger than a fanny pack, that's for sure. I love it. <laughs> cool, brother, we'll take that. So there was a bag underneath the table that had some 5200 games in there, and I went ahead and grabbed a few. I'm gonna go ahead and pick up Joust, Defender, and Pole Position. Let's go. All right, guys, we're here with Arcade Wednesdays. I'm gonna drop their link right here. First Give them a Avenger. follow. First time Vander, there you go, there you go. All right. She hooked us up with some pins right here. There you go. Now, it's always cool to find a bin full of Amiibos, especially Amiibos that are still sealed. But uh, man, I already have some of these, so I went ahead and left these behind. But they're, I don't know. Maybe I should have grabbed a few of them. Now these Taco Bell Chihuahuas were so popular in the 90s, man, they just scream nostalgia. Psst. Yo quiero Taco Bell. So we're taking the Taco Bell dogs and Tony Hawk's Pro Skater for the Nintendo 64. We came for games, but it looks like my wife's gonna be going home with some Taco Bell Chihuahuas. All right guys, it's getting dark now, it's winding down, so uh, we're gonna finish this up real quick and uh, we're gonna head out. So let's see what else we can find before we leave. I almost left my wallet here, check that out. <laughs> All right, guys, so we did some digging. It's a little how, dark out here. I take five bucks off. Yeah. Leave the wallet. <laughs> We're going to stack Harry Potter, ECW, some magical racing, and some turtles. So it's really cold right now. It's about 48 degrees, and everybody's starting to pack up because it's time to go home. It's just too cold, and WrestleMania's on. But these events are always great. They're always a good time. You're always going to find good stuff. So shout out to Pixel Vault Games for putting on such a great event, and I'm really looking forward to the next one. All right, guys, so that's all our pickups for today. Pixel Vault was a lot of fun. Had a lot of great times with a lot of great people. So, guys, I'll see you on the next one. Keep it retro. Get those wonderful toys. Isn't this a school day? Yeah.